What's up guys, this is the Roverman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the Italian Empire. As the Italian States rather. So to pick up where we left off, we have begun a series of battles against the Swedish Empire and as you can see we are now seeing the impact of that and we are being attacked. We've just come off the back of the la a large fight near Gdansk and now we're going to start probably a series of battles um, against the Swedes here in Sardinia. So the first battle is actually not as quite as massive as it could have been. Um, this is not one of our top armies because you don't have howitzers but we have a lot of good artillery, field artillery and a good amount of cavalry to chase down their artillery teams. So let's go and fight the battle. So the reason why we didn't get any reinforcements in this battle is because we've landed troops on the beach and they have no movement points. So they've attacked one of their one of our armies, and that army has to fight alone, which is definitely doable. Right now, these forces here in Sardinia are all about um, just trying to do damage. Actually, I can't put I could put artillery up here, maybe. Might not be a bad idea to have two guns up here to f engage targets at long range while we still have a good number of... Well, we still have a reasonable amount of artillery on the field to help support us on the battlefield. So let's t pick our units. Go wide. Steal one back, actually. So we do need to hold this flank. Not a great position, but it'll do. Again, I am sitting back because we've got a huge amount of troops on Sardinia to fight. So I do not want to get over... I need to do these battles efficiently. So the two guns up on the hill are these clustered units up here. You guys, your, go your job is to engage the 24-pounder howitzers, first and foremost. I mean, the first hits. Killed a gunner. Regiment of horses going straight for my gunners, I suspect. So I might actually... Which shrapnel shot? Hot fire. Let these guns up on the hill reload. And once they are reloaded. Ah, oh, okay, they've changed their minds. I was going to wait. Oh, they've come back. Too late now, we're dropping artillery in. Killed more gunners, or killed some. What's with sort of these grenadier guards? Yep, they look pretty good, as pretty as most grenadier guard units actually do. Okay, you guys, hot fire at will. Switch trap my shot. Yeah, I suspect. Yeah, they are tied. If this artillery is actually going to engage their artillery or not. Too bad. Here comes more artillery. Oh, we target. Oh, we accidentally targeted. See, these guys are going to shrapnel shot the regiment of horse. If they can hit them, you guys are still focusing on the howitzers. Alright, keep shrapnel shotting them. Although they might. The terrain might not be great for shrapnel shot here, because I think one. Yeah, that's not terrible. I mean, so if I attack the artillery, will you go spin around? Apparently not. So they're most, mostly going after this crew. These gunners up here have yet to make 
any significant advances, well, at least any significant damage. 12 pounder crew is upset. They're charging us now. They've been routed. Good. Now they are advancing, which is what we wanted to see. We knocked out one of the 13 pounder guns. Three, no, the three pounder artillery pieces. Cavalry's trying again. Yeah, back you go. If they give us an opening, I'll try and get their artillery. Because we're destroying their provincial cavalry that are acting as their guardians. That order's caused these guys to attack. Come on, knock out some of their gun crews. Although if they lose if they lose their lose most of their cavalry, then take these cuirassiers and get them over here, just in case they attempt to run up and around here. Shrapnel shot the 31st, that regiment of horse. Now they've been bugged down to one single gun. Ooh, we've made... what did we... route? Three pounders have gone. You guys. Uh, the native infantry can't form square. Uh, that's the reason why they've gone for that section of the line. You guys now switch to shrapnel shot against the incoming Swedish hordes. Counter charge their cavalry with my cavalry. Get these guys out of square, get them to push the flank like that, sort of. My cavalry's going to sort them out, no problem. My other cavalry... I don't care if they get my guns, because right now they're bugged and they're only up to one gun crew anyway. You guys go after the blunder of our shotgunners. That's the shotgunners gutted mostly. Let's run my cavalry on to go after their howitzers to prevent them from getting too close. You know, I don't want that infantry to get in there. You guys advance and push the flank. Same with this other African native infantry unit. You do not need to help them out. That's what the cavalry does. You guys go after their artillery. They're chasing you down, but they're chasing you down with provincial cavalry, which is pretty pants. Ooh, engine the guard engineers are pushing us here. Okay, they've lost all their guns, so spin around and fight the provincial infantry. You guys pivot like so.
when you're lying on the flank is giving up the ghost. Start to try and fall back. Heavy cavalry should will likely win against those chaps there. You guys are still fighting against one lone regiment of horse. That's pretty dumb. Oh, these blunder by shotgunners are pushing the flank. Let's get my general up, at, up here. No Royal Cairo infantry guards. good they're knocked out so now you can guys can line up form ranks engage maybe here you guys need to run over here you guys need to run back to the combat zone as well so do you guys need to run Come on, General's bodyguard, ignore the battle. You guys have to hit the general, the engineer. Run our cavalry straight in. Get my cavalry to hit their general. Colonial line of fighting Swedish infantry. My generals died, but that's as is tradition. All he has to do is stop stop the blunderbuss shotgunners from dying. You guys keep running. Don't worry about being shot at. You guys hit the grenadier guards. You guys hit the infantry mercenaries. Enemy general's been killed, so let's get my my cavalry back to this fight over here on the right flank. The seventh regiment is holding, which is fairly devastating. Let's get my infantry to push around. Okay, they've broken. Get you guys into the fight in the front line. General's bodyguard is about to row, which isn't great. You guys charge the engineers. You guys are gonna go, pikemen! Run, 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 run! Cavalry's been routed. General's bodyguard is holding on. You guys all gang up on that engineer unit. You guys all gang up on that footline unit. Okay. Now my general's routed, so my guns are gonna are gonna be lost soon. Let's get the 61st in. Come on, you guys. Kill the engineers. You guys probably need to push it up. Like so. You guys switch to... What I want, really, is to do this. Right. Howitzers are coming in. Are dropping in fire. You guys all swarm the 61st. Where's my heavy cavalry? Yeah, except the guns are lost. Too bad most of these guys can't. Are not going to be useful. I'm 
you guys cast a shot the 105th. You guys all stop to just run back here. It looks like our flank here is going to fold pretty conclusively. You guys hold fire. Let's get my cuirassiers over on the other flank. You guys start to canister shot the Swedish Dragoons. Try and form a last redoubt. We managed to rout those cavalry. Okay, you guys run back. Rely on my cuirassiers to help you out. So you guys have to rely on... Right, now you guys can fire at will. Blunderbuss shotgunners are on a bit of a roll. So my cuirassiers, that your job is to buy time. You engage the Grenadiers. Crassiers are gone. The Regiment of Horse is pushing up. You guys deploy into square. Get my native infantry to run towards my square formation. You guys engage the Dragoons. Everyone else will be repelled in due course. Even this regiment of horse, because you're going to be... You ran into my square, me old mucker. Although they're now wavering, and they broke, which is super lame. So let's just swarm that regiment of horse with everything we've got. said with everything we've got as they route. Pikemen are in. My main, a core of my infantry can't form square against the Royal Swedish Dragoons. So they can't realistically stop them. Let's pivot these men. Their pikes have hit my line. Okay, African native infantry. Bad idea. Turns out, not having infantry that can uh, form square to defend itself is pretty fundamental. Oh, damn, and they've got howitzers up as well. Yeah, these guys are done. They're so done. So let's try and get into a combat that will cause them to lose men if they how it's uh, if they quick climb us. You guys actually might go to fight off the grenadiers. No, I doubt it. If these guys can't hold, then you're done for. Yeah. Turns out. Yeah. Turns out. <laughs> <laughs> African native infantry is pretty poor. I expected them to be not so good from a pure stat perspective, but I didn't expect them to be... I, well, I forget that they can't form square, realistically. Pikemen are going to cut through them pretty easy. Oh, and the regiment of horse came back. Oh, and this unit of African native infantry came back. Not that they'll do much good. Yeah, there we go. Don't bother coming back if you can't do anything. Oh, that's the most annoying thing when your units come back in penny packet formations. Okay, let's set you guys up like so. Because they may as well all try and fall back and try and fight together. Rather than like the light, the light foot, we can't win. So they may as well 
try and form a position, reload, and try and pour some fire onto them. But it looks like the the pikemen are going to chase them down successfully. So you men charge pikemen. There we go, they've been routed. <laughs> so even if we didn't die, we've still got I got, I got artillery just constantly pounding us from range. Well, native infantry, infantry is not going to be any good because this guy's out here, so they're going to take. They're going to have to take time to reform. Yeah, they go the Royal Cairo Infantry Guards. Now it's all on these two gate units. Loading and firing as often as they can. It will not be enough. Yeah, they're going to break. Yeah, they're nearly full strength unit of Swedish troops. Yeah. Valiant defeat. Gah. Yeah. Turns out, yeah, don't, don't waste your time with these guys. <laughs> don't waste your time. So those units there feel a bit uh isolated which which they are well i think that's there's two there's two angles to that defeat there's the native african infantry uh lack of square formation was pretty devastating because it meant they folded at the first sight of, inf of cavalry and it also meant i had to use my other colonial light to actually do stuff yeah uh, put a school there Okay, so these guys, their odds are looking pretty slim, but that's kind of why we're pouring them in, pouring them in the meat grinder. Ooh, riflemen, there we go. May as well have Lisbon also working on this. Let's get a Lancer Guard, Heavy Cavalry, Curacier. Just got to keep pouring men in because ultimately they can't. They can't replenish. Well they, they, well, they can't afford to replenish this many men, and they can't. They don't have the capacity from Cagliari to do that either. So you're probably going to go hit Stur Halberg. It depends how strong he is. Yeah, mostly you've actually got good stuff. So let's go fight Stur to the north, just to prevent him from having free reign of the uh, northern German plain. We don't want them being able to run around and take advantage of our space behind our front line. So let's put... There we go. Artillery to the back. Field artillery to the back. How it says form up. Formal, formal almighty line, so we've got to remember they do have a strong cavalry contingent, but that's it, that's their only strength. So let's... Do something like this. We've got lots of these. Uh, Hakapi. Hakapelita. Oh, the artillery reigns in. We're going to storm in, take them out. Lots of this cavalry is going to break trying to charge our lines, although it looks pretty good. They're kind of like marines on horses. Pikemen. So let's switch to Okay, you guys run to something like there. You guys push up that flank. Yeah, they immediately stop because they suddenly go, hang on. Come and stop us, cavalry. Yes, 
the light force. Form you guys all into square. Come after us, cavalry. You got nothing. Back here is the main... That's the main place we're interested in. So these marines, fortunately, are on the flank. In comes the cavalry. Okay, so what I want is for these three units to push the flank. You men push up right into their faces. You men push up like that. Yep, harches are engaging. No, Marine, stay in square, you damn fool. These guys sign up, line up like so. So we need to send some men up into the front to keep the militia occupied, but then these guys on the flank are going to pour some good fire into them, as well as my quick climbing howitzers. Yep, another cavalry unit char cavalry charge. These lifeguards afoot will not last very long. Pikemen actually might get some good charges off. You guys charge the pikes. go. Lifeguard's horse is still charging. Let's switch to round shot. Okay, you guys hop in square. Still coming in. going to be bloodily repulsed. There's another light horse unit. There they go. So then these men can all push up and take that hill. Artillery to engage that regiment of foot. There we go. Should get you guys just to push up as well, right into their face. I'm not afraid of melee combat with Sweden. Hey! Cavalry's come back. Can you drop into square? I've got plenty of infantry to do what I want to do. And my artillery to focus on the light horse to the rear. And the howitzers just keep dropping shells in. Are they charging? They are. Will you guys all drop into square just in case? And you. Squares for days. There we go. Now the head of that column is getting minced. You men go hit the pikeman. There we go. You're not going to be very happy. They've got General's Bodyguard right at the rear. There 
you guys chase down the pikemen because they're spread out a bit. Let's turn off my howitzers. Jamal's bodyguard is just within range. Although not massively so, so let's push up. These artillerymen are going down. This is the worst melee combat I've seen in a long time, because they're all running in the wrong they're all running the wrong direction, so I want you to flank that position there. Gemma's bodyguard is just running around because it can't. Plus it can't influence the battle. Let's drop all you guys into square. Except for you, actually, you can get some good shots. Well no, you won't get some good shots. Actually you did. It's a bit of a surprise. Charge! Stop my artillery from shooting in general. I was going to say, that light horse can't stick around for long, surely. You guys are going to swarm the first regiment of foot. the general he's just loit he's, oh, he's just running he's gonna get a rear charge off here here but it's not gonna help there they all go good you scallywags ah, right so where are they going to route towards Although, how many of them are left? Uh, you can auto the rem remaining troops. There we go. Shoot men, train up, and let's also get some cuirassier. Let's recruit, let's retrain, rebuild this uh, port. Let's also go. Well, we're building up the navy here, that's okay. So we've taken Gdansk. They've got Konigsberg, have they? Well, let's take our army that suffered the battering before the gate to Sweden and replenish them. Let's keep Balthazar here in position. Let's get George, Giordano Antelioni, Antonelli, charge up to Konigsberg, demand the surrender of the city. Uh, unsurprising. You might be able to intercept those Russians. That's kind of what you guys were. I don't know where the hell they're going. You go chase them down. We've got our troops in the Russian rear, though, so it's demand the surrender here at Arkhangelsk. Let's rebuild. Do they have any towns? No towns. But they have top tier infrastructure. This army march on towards Komi. Can you abandon, not abandon, but can you leave Arcane Josk immediately? Not, not really. If you wait a turn, you can then march up to this crossing in the, this opening in the forest here. So you men, you start converting Komi, no, you start converting Archangels, this guy starts converting Komi towards the true faith. Let's do some building. Church school in St. Petersburg, yeah. Actually, you can go annihilate that guy that's lead through our lines. Yeah. You can chase down the remainders. 
Hurrah! You guys combine forces. You are on the march, probably up to here, to try and push back this force and hit Petrovskaya. Pushing into south, you need reinforcements. No, don't need howitzers, you want just regular good old infantry. Can we abandon Crimea? You know they really don't like it, so that's understandable. To be honest, it'll take a bit longer, but I'll have to build, knock down one of these pleasure gardens in order to re rebuild it with a Catholic school. Down here in Egypt, we have this army that's kind of hunkered down. You're replenishing on the borders on this river crossing. Your garrison in Cairo, which we're building walls in. Let's build some artillery and some cavalry to join this small force here. Let's upgrade these buildings here. Let's take this building that's not got anything in it and build a church school to help start. Well, I mean, we've converted the region pretty well, but a church school will help that speed that process up. I mean, you just get back into the port there. You get back in there. My agents are on the move. And we're pushing up in general against the Russians, although the Swedes have to be our priority. I might send you guys back just to clean up some of the detritus behind the lines. Although it's a shame we're going to bring in another army. Um, or I could just fight it to save the save the uh, attrition on this army. But looking at the episode, looking at the timer rather, I think it's time to end the episode. So, thanks for watching guys, hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for yet another fight against the Swedish forces. Cheers everyone.